Hello, let me call you back. I made it. I made it. I've been called back. Oh! I'm so happy for you. Thank you, sweetheart. Not only that, mm -hmm. I'll be starting work tomorrow at Adam's Chambers. Wow. Mm -hmm. wow. Mm -hmm. wow. Mm -hmm. This is nice. This calls for a celebration. Of course. Um, Come inside, I have a surprise for you. Oh. Come on. My goodness, you are full of surprises. Anyway, now that everything is over, we have to celebrate. Fiance and I came with this drink to say thank you for the job. Yes, sir. That is why we are here with this to say thank you. This is not necessary. I mean, you deserve the job. Hmm? Here we go for the best, and uh, you were the best, and that was why we offered you the job. Thank you, sir. Uh, well, um, young man, sir. You are very lucky to have had her as your fiancé. I mean, you have to make hay while the sun shines. If not, another man will overtake you. Claire, that's what we're praying for. Pray. <laughs> you see, young man, you see, God will not do for you what you can do for yourself. So I suggest you go and prepare and marry her. Or don't you have a good job? Uh, sir, I'm a, I'm a driver. Yes, sir. He's a driver. A driver? Yes. You mean a public bus driver? No, 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 no. I work with Felinco Limited. Okay. Um, I see. Come here, please. You sent for me, sir. Oh, yes. Please sit down. Thank you. How are you? I'm very well, sir. There is a saying in my place that what you eat is what your mouth smells like. Did you say that young man is your fiancé? Yes, sir. How did you end up with him? I mean, you are too beautiful and intelligent to end up with such a man. Uh, sir, he's a nice man. Hmm. Our story is a long one. Story? People rewrite long stories to short ones for better appreciation and enjoyment. Look, I'm not saying you should ditch him or break his heart. All I'm saying is, go and think about it. Hmm? Thank you, sir. I'll take it. Yeah, I'm 
voltas para mim. Bella, what is it? Nothing. I mean... I think Juma should go back to school. Yes. How do I introduce him to my friends and colleagues as my fiance, let alone my husband? Love has no class, Bella. I think I can sense what is coming. But my advice to you is that love conquers all. I mean, this boy could go back to school. But don't make him feel inferior in any way. Please. My son, I brought this bottle of drink in appreciation to say thank you for everything you have done in the life of my daughter. Mama, thank you very much. I appreciate it. But you don't really have to come with this to thank me. All I did, I did it for love. <laughs> yes, she's a good woman. Yeah, you, don't have, you don't really need to come and thank me, thank me with a bottle of brandy. But I still have to thank you. If you didn't send her to the university, she wouldn't be what she is today. So I owe you a million thanks and I will keep thanking you, thanking you, thank you, say thank you. Thank God. You're welcome. Thank you. Ne. Get your mother something to eat. Ah, my mother will go in your bed. will go inside. I know, just get her something to eat. Mama. No, I'm not some mama. Yeah, welcome. Tell us something for you. Mama, how is work? Mama, you will eat inside and when we go inside. Eh, no. Let's go, let's go. I need to go and see your mother. See my mother. See my mother for what? She was here yesterday. You could have told her whatever you wanted to tell her yesterday. See, Bella. We can continue living as if I do not have the interest in making you my wife. We don't have to go through this again. I just got a new job and I need to concentrate and... And, and what? And what? Eh? Are you not going to get married? We never discussed marriage and I'm not ready to get married now. Good night. Him, yes, but that does not mean I must get married to him now that my career has just begun. That is the point, Bella. You still love him, but moving out of his house will make him feel that you're separating from him entirely. Don't you get it? Was I even planning to live with him after graduation? No, I need to get a life. So, are you taking him to the bus for lunch? The boss said that she bring him. I will do just that.
Young man. Hmm? Are you all right? Mm -hmm. I can't be all right. When this thing is dealing with me. I have to take my food home. Take it easy now. Eh? <clears throat> this is so disgusting and repugnant. Excuse me. I'm so sorry, sir. This is the height of embarrassment, Juma. What is wrong with you? What have I done? What have you not done? You have a terrible table manner. You just messed up before my boss. And to crown it all, you want to take the food home. Tell me you brought the food home. What would I have done? To allow the food waste? Yeah. I thought the one you did back there was the highest. I have seen it all. Come and join you. Dilly and I have found an apartment. You did? But, but, but you didn't tell me. But I told you when I asked you for some money. I, I thought the money was for something else. <clears throat> Listen, you don't need to be scared. We can still live together. I just need some seriousness in this job. When the time comes, we will live together, okay? Bella say. If you want, I can rent a comfortable and a bigger apartment for us. We don't need to live apart. Why do I have to keep repeating myself to you? This is your house. You have tried for me. It is high time I left. Yes, Bella. No, 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 please, please. No room for argument here. My mind is made up. First thing tomorrow morning, I'm packing into my new apartment. Good night. Bella, Bella is your house too. We can live together. Good morning, beautiful. Where are you headed? I'm waiting for a taxi. That doesn't answer my question. Okay, sorry. I'm going to Bank Road. Oh, fine. That's along my way. Hop in. I'll drop you off. <laughs> Sir, please. I don't want to inconvenience you. Let, let that be my worry. Don't worry. Just hop in. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome.
what's the name? Bella. Bella, nice name. And you're beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> I'm Oscar. And I'm single. What do you want to hear? You are just trying to be smart. Oh, really, Emma? Oh, yes, you are. <laughs> <laughs> Good to meet you, anyways. <laughs> Thank you very much for the right. You're welcome. It's my pleasure, okay? Um, we can see some other time. Okay, sorry. Let me just um, give you my card. Give me a call later today so we can at least have lunch when you're free. Okay. All right. Take care of yourself. You too. Bye-bye. Chuma crying while Bella was laughing at him. I'm sure. I'm sure. Call him now. Mama, I have. I have called him twice, but his number has been switched off. Go ahead and call him. Going again. Switched off. Hey. I'm worried though. Mama, I am scared. I hope he's fine. I have this kind of dream. It means my brother is in trouble. I love your brother is fine, okay? All you need is to call him. I believe he will certainly on his phone. Just relax your mind. <sighs> but do you think it's it's a good idea for me to go to the city to see him? At least to check on him. Well, it will be a good idea. But let's wait till tomorrow, okay? If by tomorrow he didn't pick, then I'll give you some money. You go and check him up. You want to see him up. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Just relax yourself. I have to go now. Oh no. Stay for a while. I'll come back later. Come back. Come back. Yeah. What's that? What do you mean, what's that? A move, of course. Do you want to counter it? Watch me. Okay. Uh-huh. Oh. Mm-hmm. And then you think you just said something Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. If it's true, tell him that I'm not at home. Okay. Good 
morning. Good morning, darling. How are you? Um, I'm fine. Is you feel like you? Um, oh, no, she's not. She went out. She went to see a client. You didn't tell her that I was here yesterday. Oh, my bad. I'm, I'm so sorry. I forgot. <laughs> Please. It's okay. Did you cook anything now? I'm very hungry. Um, no, I did not. So I've been busy with chores. I didn't make anything. Ah. Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, I'll be leaving. I'll, I'll come back later. All right. That's fine. Okay. Okay, have a nice day. Uh, bye. Bye. Bella. Bella. Come out. Azika, what's going on? What do you mean, what is going on? I mean, with the Chuma, what is going on? Babes, can we continue with our game? Don't tell me let's continue with the game. Obviously, something is wrong. Why are you treating him like you despise him? Wait, Delia. If you were in my shoes, what would you do? Would you sit and relax and enjoy the company of an illiterate? Bella, for goodness sake, what has come over you? Oh, oh suddenly, Chuma is an illiterate and not good enough for you. Babes, I don't know what is going on, but trust me, this is not fair. I've heard you. When you're done, we'll continue with that game. But I know no waiting I do Anything may be a day for ground I'm sorry, forgive me Nothing I thought They change your mind Is it that she doesn't want to see me or what? Before you go There is one thing you must do for me Before you go Show me how to live without your love I'm beginning to see that Bella Bella is avoiding me. Why did he say so? I went to her house yesterday and her friend told me that she wasn't around. And today again the same thing happened. You see, when I told you not to pay the rent for her, did you listen to me? You see? What would I have done? Hi! You would have allowed her to stay with you. And you will fall up with you know, got her pregnant. Mika, you don't understand. Mika, Bella is sleeping out from my hand. Eh? She don't come here anymore, and she don't even pick my calls anymore. My friend, I would advise you to get ready for what is coming. What is coming? Separation, Chuma. Can't you see it? That girl has started seeing real men who can give her what she wants in a twinkle of an eye. You can stop this. You're making me scared. No, that is the truth. That is the truth, Chuma. Can't you see it? I, mean, I, I don't want to. Please, please. Eh. Chuma, you should have taken her on her ways and got her pregnant before her law school. Yes. Yeah, it's just doing as if you don't know what's up. Baby, don't go. Show me how to live without you. If you leave me, I go die. You teach me how to live without your love. To jump on the hand of me, to sleep on the hand of me. Chuma, you almost scared me. Good morning. What is going on? How do you mean? You've been avoiding me. What have I done? No, man. I am not avoiding you, okay? I have been very busy with work. I come back late every day. And I always have hectic day at the office. So you're not too busy to stop by and check on me? I'm sorry about that. I'll check on you one of these days, okay? Right now, I need to run along. I'm late for work already. Apologize, I'm sorry, but I know no waiting I do. Anything may be a day for ground, I'm sorry, forgive me. Nothing I talk, they change your mind. Just got to I will love you, no tell me why. Before
You're <laughs> going to make me blush too much. But you're beautiful, that's the truth. <laughs> you're being too romantic. Well, I have no apologies for that. That's my nature. Here we go. Thank you for the lunch. I had fun. I mean, I've not had such fun in a long while. You're welcome. I'll give you a call. Okay. Fine. Okay. Fine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's that excitement all about? What's that look on your face? He's here. <laughs> oh, please. Oscar. Oscar, hey. Ha! <laughs> sweetheart. Meet my friend, Delia. Delia, meet my sweetheart, Oscar. <laughs> Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm um, well. Um, honey, I need to rush now. I got to call from the hospital. There's an emergency. Okay, love. All right. I'll see you all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll see you some other time. Oh, yes, that's fine. Right. Oh, yeah. Get tired of kissing. I will you. never get tired of you. <laughs> hmm? All right, darling. All right. Take care of yourself. Okay, and you too. Let me be on my way. All right. You know I'm going to miss you, right? I will miss you more. You sure? Yeah. Huh? Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Tell me it's happened. Delia, please, don't make me look like a small girl. I know what I want. I love him. You love him. And you let him get you laid on the first date in your house? Bella, what is wrong with you? What happened to self-worth? What happened to self-control? What happened to women's pride? Delia, please, he will not lecture me on how to live my life. 
in my house. What is wrong with making love to a man that I love? A man you barely know, Bella. A man you just met. My goodness, Bella, this is shameful. You can't even deal with this. What are you doing here, me? You did? What are you doing here? Why are you smiling? I got a gift for you. A gift? Yes. Where is the gift? This is your car. Oh, be serious. I'm late for work. Be serious. I'm not joking. Here are the keys. I'm oh, sorry. You mean you bought this car for me? For you. Strictly for you. Sorry. <laughs> so I, you bought this car for me? This is your car, baby. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you deserve everything good. And more. I don't know what to say, honestly. Don't I don't say anything. I'm sort of wet. <laughs> Why don't you just get into the car and take me around? You can see that again. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's go. All right, baby. <laughs> Open the door. <laughs> I lost my boss yesterday. Sorry about that. Just that? You don't care to know why the company collected the boss from me? Will you bring the boss back? He just heard me say, I'm sorry about that. Well, you're talking to me. Oh. What do you want me to do? Start shedding tears because the company collected their boss? Bella, this boss we are talking about fed us and provided for us for six years. You see? I said it. That is why it is very, very bad to deal with illiterates like you. Must you remind me that that boss fed me for six years? Must you? Baby, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I reacted that way. No? I am not surprised that you overreacted. That is what people of no class Illiterates, that is how they react. Excuse me. Now I know I was a fool. You played me like a game. So I say thank you for breaking my heart. doing here oh okay you want my neighbors to think I lost my job yesterday and I need you to console me I haven't been paid for, for like a month now mm, okay I, 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 and I have not eaten anything since since yesterday uh, now what do you want me to do Bella, do you have food in the house I, 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 I let me just Here, go out there and get yourself some food to eat, okay? I'm late for work.
Bella. What is this? You now have a car you never care to tell me. I don't have to blow my Change your mind, you scared now. I will love you. No, tell me why. Before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how to live without your love. I beg you, teach me how to live without your love. To jump on the hand of me, to sleep on the hand of me. You must teach me, cause I don't know how to live without your love. Are you still here lamenting about what? Hmm? Hmm? Something happened today. What happened? Bella now has a car. Wow! It's good news. That means she has started receiving fat salary. I told her I lost my boss and she didn't even bother to console me. And the most heartbreaking was that I told Bella that I was hungry, all she could do is to give me 500 naira. Eh? <laughs> well, like I told you, you have not even started seeing wonders. Very soon, she will still stop you from coming to her house. I know that. I think she's seen another man. Oh, you have started thinking like I do. Hi. Thank God you have woken up. Can I break it down for you now? Yes, I see heartbreak around the corner. <laughs> heartbreak! I don't want to lose Bella. And I'll never lose her. Never. Eh? Well, you have to start thinking on how to get another boss. At least feed yourself. And stop thinking about someone who does not even love you. Yes! Chuma. Okay. I mean, how do you think that a lawyer like me will settle for an illiterate bus driver like you? Hell no. <laughs> eh? Bella, you said this to me. Oh, please. A man that fed you. A man that gave you life. You gave me life? How? Are you the only person that trained someone in the university before? Are you? See, at times you need to talk with your senses. You're just an illiterate. Bella, me, illiterate. You called me an illiterate. I advise you go look for your class, okay? Please, stop bugging me. Bella, it's okay, but it's very unfair. It's very, very unfair. Have a nice day. No problem. Before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how to live without your love. I beg you, teach me how to live without your love. To jump on the hand of me, to sleep on the hand of me. You must teach me, cause I don't know how to live without your love. Don't you think that was rather too harsh? Delia, please, please, this is my life. You have no right to tell me how to live it. Okay, okay. Can you just calm down and let me talk? I will not calm down. And I will not listen to you because you're not making sense. I will start listening to you when you start talking sense. Right now, you're talking nonsense. Wait, wait a minute. So now I am talking nonsense. Of course, you are. Telling me how to run my affairs. 
Okay. Let me take that nonsense state of mind and tell you the truth, darling. Chuma does not deserve any form of heart. That guy has shown you so much love and care. Genuine love for that matter. Listen to me, Bella. Even if you decide not to marry him, there are other ways to go about it without hurting him. I can't believe this is happening. Bella, how can you forget in a hurry? Isabella. And what were you doing there? I came to look for my late father's friend who promised to send me to the university. But he tried to rape me, so I ran away from his house. Oh. I'm sorry about that, oh. Thank you. What of your parents? My father died while going to the village in a boat. Hey. My poor mother and my sister in the village. I don't even have money to go back to the village. Uh, have you eaten? Yes, I ate a car. Stop crying, oh. Stop crying. I'll, I'll get you something to eat now, oh. I'll get you food to eat. Just stay here, I'm coming, oh. wallet yesterday. You did? I knew the owner will come back for you. Oh. oh, thank God. <laughs> Hold on, let me do it for you. All right. Everything is intact, complete. Yeah. Oh, Choma, I will surprise you for this. Uh, yeah, yeah, you don't have any problem. Even if it's not mine, I wouldn't have taken anything from it. Choma, oh, thank you so much. Um, meanwhile, um, come and give me some fruit. Watermelon, yeah. pineapple, purple, one, 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 one. Choma, Choma. This one, two or one? Uh, yeah, one, 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 one. I'll check it's okay, it's okay. Mm. All right. mm. Hold on, let me get your change. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, Choma, Choma, don't worry. Keep, you can keep the change. Keep it. Keep it, okay? Okay, Ben, leave that in, leave that in. Take Choma, change, I said change. keep the change. I'm giving it to you from my heart. Not because I picked your wallet that you leave your change for me. Not because you picked my wallet, but boys like you are rare to find these days. God will bless you. Keep the change. Okay, okay, no problem. Okay. What do I have to go? Oh, 
about you, man? Yeah. Hello, man. You didn't tell me that your sister came. Was I tell you everything? Was <laughs> I tell you everything? I go. Like gossip. Are you even sure she's your sister? Is it your business? Eh? What's your business? Chuma, I understand. Hey! You're welcome. Thank you. How are you? Fine. Ah, you sold everything. Everything. Today is wonderful. Hey. <laughs> so, what about you? How did it go? Well, I tried my best. I knew it. I knew you have a good face. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice. I bought something for you. What's that? Look at it first. Open it first. Look at it. You're welcome. You like them, eh? Come here. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome. They are so nice. Yeah. By the way, how did you know my size? Uh, why wouldn't I know your size? <laughs> why wouldn't I know your size? I have eyes now. Eh? Mm. Why don't you wear them to see if they fit you? Okay, I'll go for that. No, I'm not going to eat it. I'll go to the bathroom and wear it. No, I'm closing my eyes. It's very idea? nice. No, yeah. no. <laughs> Madi, how are you? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Okay, so how is market? As you can see, if it's going well. Yeah, um, I'm not seeing Choma. Where is he? Okay, he's not back yet. Oh. Okay. Um, Chuma, can you drive? Oh, yes, I can drive. I learned how to drive long time ago. Very good. In that case, um, our company is looking for a company driver. And the salary is very fast. Please tell me. I, I can try. You have the job already. <laughs> See what you're going to do, eh? You'll start work tomorrow morning. Okay. Get yourself prepared. Come out very early. I'll pick you up on my way going to work. Oh. God Thank bless you. you. Thank you, sir. God bless you. May God bless you. You merit it. <laughs> so I will see you. Bye bye. I am so happy for you. I'm, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. Can you see love? Just like that. You almost sold everything. <laughs> yes, and, and you too. You sold everything. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> Let's back up and go home. Good luck. Good news. Let's back up. Let's back up. Just like that. Let's back up and go home. Back, 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 back. <laughs> oh. So, Mama, that was what happened. Chai. Mm -hmm. mm. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. God Thank you. bless you. Mm. Amen. Hi. Hey, I thought I have lost my daughter. Eh? If not for poverty. I Obonya Degemba. Eh? If not for poverty, would I have allowed that rapist to take her to the city? Why mm. Thank you. It's okay, hey. don't worry, eh? Bella and I will be going to the city together. Mm. Yeah, she'll be staying in my other sister's house. And also she'll be managing my small business till she take her job. Wait, oh, you mean you want to help us send her to the university? Yeah. Our God will make it happen. Oh! Thank you. Thank you, my son. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Juma, you have done enough for me. Mm. Not worry, eh? Don't bother yourself, you'll be fine. Hmm? Hmm? Thank you. Come, let's start going. We have a long way to go. 
Let me. Na afu ne riabu. Nkasi abu aso no do. Let me get some fufu. Na fruit. Mama, we have all those. Let me go and. We have them in the city. When we get to the city, we eat. Don't worry. Don't worry. I will come and see you next month. Cheers. Bye, girl. Bye bye, sir. Bye. So tap on me. Bye bye. Then the banana Very delicious. Have you noticed that I added some weight? Mm-hmm. I noticed it. And you're more beautiful now. All oh, thanks to you. All oh, thanks to God Almighty. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. When I become a lawyer, I will deal with anyone that looks for a job. Hmm? You want to be a lawyer? Yes. I go dress. Daddy, you know one thing I like about you, eh? Your passion for education. Hmm. I love it about you. I have passion for education. In fact, I was the best in my set in secondary school. I came out with five A's and four B's. Ekukone? Yes. That's wonderful. You need to go to university. God will help me. Hmm. You don't know. If you go to university now, who will be cooking this kind of food for me? I'll be coming back from time to time. <laughs> That's good for you. <laughs> So I was paid today. Seventy thousand naira. Oh my goodness! Yes. Oh, <laughs> I'm so happy for you. <laughs> you are going to buy your jam form tomorrow. <gasps> yes. Are you serious? <laughs> Very serious. <laughs> Too honestly, I don't know what to say. You're such a kind person. Hey, thank hey, you. God hey. bless you. Hey, oh, thank you. But stop it, <laughs> eh? Always pray for me that God will continue to provide for us. And God must continue to provide for us. Amen. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Don't worry. Can I help you? Okay. Come on, come on. <laughs> Even tomorrow, I'll go and buy my dad. Tomorrow, tomorrow. Hey! 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 Oh my goodness, I'm so happy, I'm so happy, I'm so happy. Okay. Hey. 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 I want to check my jam results. <laughs> and what is your score? Nessie. You don't have to frown your face, eh? By next year, you will read well and get fully prepared. Okay? Cheer up. Cheer up, oh. Come, let's go out there. Yeah! I made it! Ah! I made it! I scored 274! Look at this! I'll just feel your legs. You tried, though. <laughs> wow! Yes! Wow! Mm -hmm. Oh, baby! Oh, baby! Oh, baby! Oh, baby. 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 Oh,
Oh baby! Oh baby! Oh baby! I knew it! I knew it! I knew you would make it! Yes! This is nice! This is wonderful! This is wonderful! Thank you! You know what? Go and get dressed! I am taking you out for lunch. I'm coming. 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 I'm <laughs> Can you imagine? I knew it! Eh? Can we continue? Let's continue. Let me let me let me finish you. Let me finish you. Eh, do it first, do it first, do it first. Do it first. Ah, this is my girl. Wonderful! Hi! Oh baby! Oh baby! I see you're not ready to play again. Oh, baby. So, my dear, you know tomorrow is going to be the first day you'll be in the university. Hmm? So, I don't need to tell you to focus on your books, mind your studies, because I believe that you're going to make me proud. Honestly, it's still like a dream to me. You picked me from nowhere and now I am here. Ready to... <sighs> Thank you so much. Thank you for everything. God bless you. I've told you, always return the thanks given to God. Hmm? Because He's the one doing everything. Okay? <laughs> I love you. What? I love you. No. I can't let this happen. my heart very well but I couldn't find we have wronged you. Chuma please get up and leave. You're embarrassing me in my office. Please leave. Baby do you, do you want to kill me? Do you, do you want me to die? Okay if you want to die fine but go to your house. Go home and die okay? Please Chuma Chuma please don't force me to call the security on you. Please. Am I interrupting some? Oh no darling. You're not interrupting anything. Just some illiterate nuisance that do not know that this is an office. Bella, that's too harsh. Dahlia, please, please help me talk to her, please. Dahlia, I am, I am, I am, I am shattered. I'm shattered. Chuma, it's okay. Just stand up. No, no, don't get up. Stay there and be mewing like a cat. Don't leave. Get out. Go, go, go. Fine. That's the file of the 13 years old girl that was raped at the Baba shop. Take a look at it. Okay, fine. But just get him out of here, please. Mm. Sure. Can I have a word with you, please? Sorry. 
Shall never be well with poverty. I don't understand. Are you alright? If you see poverty, tell him or her, I said, that he's going to die a painful death. Chuma. You won't let me eat here. Mm. You're so romantic. I wonder why you're still single. Because I've been waiting for you. Now that you're here, everything has become beautiful. <laughs> Since I met you, I have known the real taste of love. Hmm. You treat me with so much care and respect. I wish this doesn't stop. I'm not ready to stop. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> Thank you, baby. Thank you. It's for you. Uh huh. No, you won't do this. <laughs> Watch me. Please. Watch me. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> That's sweet, so yes. <laughs> I can't trade you for anything in this world. Me too, baby. Mm. You're just I'd the best. <laughs> What were you talking about? Chuma, when did you come back? Mama, you didn't even know that he's back. What happened, my son? Eh? Chuma. 
but I saw him under the tree. We book in poverty. I was confused. Ma, what happened, my son? Talk to me. I am your mother. Chuma, talk to us now. What happened? Talk to me, I'm your mother. Chuma, what is the problem? Hey! Hey, Memo. I don't know who's you. I don't stay one minute without me. It is called addiction. Mm -hmm. I'm addicted to you. Oh, yeah? yeah. <laughs> and I know what you want. Ah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm going to give it to you just the way you like it. But when I'm done cooking. Okay? No, the food can wait five minutes. To get born? No, five minutes, please. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> five minutes. Mm -hmm. Five minutes. Okay. Five minutes. Okay, five minutes. Five minutes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Where's Tina? Um, she, she's not back yet. Oscar. No. I want to see you in your bedroom right now. Now? Yes, I said now. Who is she? She's just my colleague. And what is she doing here? She lost her mother recently, so she came here to cool off. You're not ashamed of yourself. Mba! You're not! Now listen and listen good. The next time I see her here, I will deal with her. Rubbish. I'm sorry, Mom. What's the money you promised me? Mom, Tina has not sent the money yet. Can you hear yourself? Tina has not sent the money yet. You don't work, Abby. Let me have it. I want to leave here. Fast. Mom, it's my house. It's my house rent I want to give you. House rent I'm giving you. Um, let me have it. I'll be coming back for my monthly allowance. Mom. Yes. That girl. That girl. <laughs> what kind of a thing is this now? What kind of a something is this now? Why didn't you introduce me to your mom? I was going to take you to her this weekend. You should have just introduced me to her right there. I'm your girlfriend for crying out loud. No! You're not my girlfriend. What? You're my fiancé. 
Then make it formal. So I will know you're serious. I love you. I love you. Talk your own. <laughs> stop. Talk your own. <laughs> stop. Talk your own. Talk Hey, we met. I will never put myself this kind of shoe. Oh, no. What is it? Hmm. Oh, the one man, this one you're walking and you're snapping your fingers. Women, women, mm. what have men done to you? Baby, hmm? go home and hear it from yourself. Go and hear it from the horse's mouth. Ah, women. Oh. What do you mean by it's better you go home and hear from the horse's mouth? Who is it? Horse, who is the horse in my house? We men, we men, we men. It's your brother, he's back. Chuma, my brother, hmm. hey, Chuma, one name. Is he back? He's back. Hmm. He came back with a bad news, very bad news. So go home and meet him. He came back with a bad news. Obi, is Chuma okay? What happened to Chuma, Obi? Go home. Ah, Chuma. Mama, Rachuma, what's happening? What's this bad news Obi is talking about? Mm. That orphan Mary girl has left your brother for another man. Bella, hey, Mama, I said it. I knew this was going to happen. I knew it. When Brochuma brought that Bole or Bella into this house, I told you that she wasn't a good woman for Buddha, but he wouldn't listen. It will never be well with that girl. Mama Funati, Do not lay a curse on her. It is not her fault. When Brochuma decided to spend his money, all of his money to send her to school, did he even remember that I have not gone to the university yet? I think he deserves whatever is happening to me. Ego, this is not the time for this. Brother, can you recall exactly what I told you the very first time I set my eyes on that girl? Prochuma said that he is training a total stranger in the university while I am in the village waiting on God. But that is not enough reason for you to walk out on us. It is an insult. Mama, mama, please be cool. Don't push to me. Don't even start. Meanwhile, go and tell your son that girl does not love him. You did not do anything at home today. You did not cook, neither did you sweep the compound. What were you doing? Mama, I have decided that I will stare at this wired result all through today. Mama, do you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me that my own blood brother is there training a total stranger in school, Mama. But I've told you that I will talk to him. That's what you always say. You will talk to him. You will talk. Mama, do you even need to talk to Brachuma before he will do the right thing? Mama, do you need to remind him that I need to go to school? Who talked to him when he was training that, that total stranger in school? Where am I go? In a bad speed. Calm down. How are you even sure that it is your brother that is training that girl? How am I sure? Mama, 
his neighbor a maker told me that Pachuma gives him money to go and give to that evil girl. I will not do anything in this account until you talk to Pachuma. You tell him that I need to go to school. Oh. You see? School, you must go. I must talk to Chuma. Eh? That is my promise to you. You better talk to him. You better talk to him. <laughs> Now we are here. See where it has landed you, brother. My dear. Ego. You should go and console your brother. Come on, go console him. It's okay. Don't worry, God will send you a better woman. A woman who will truly love you. Please cheer up. Cheer up, my son. My love, I just finished. Whose earrings is this? My love, this this is yours. Don't be silly. What do you mean this is yours? I don't wear this kind of earrings. Moreover, what is it doing here? I mean, what is it doing in your drawer? My love, I, I, I don't know. And um, please don't don't make this look like, like I'm cheating on you. Remember. Hey, do I look like a child to you? Are you playing games with me? My love, can, can you just stop? <laughs> really? You're raising your voice? This is yours, this please. Is fine. Listen, listen. You remember when we bought this year? You, 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 I know you don't like this color, but this is yours. Why, why, why are you acting up like this every time? I don't, I don't know why, why you treat me like this. My love, listen, please, I, 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 I'm telling you the truth. And this whole thing is happening now that he has lost his job. I don't understand. My love, you know, this is that's part of life. You know, this is one of those things that a man sees in life. Okay, just cheer up, relax. All will be well. And, but if I'm your brother, I will go back to school. I will look for money and go back to school. Even if it is part time. Look for money from where? You don't understand, do you? I am telling you that Chuma has lost everything. He has lost everything, including his job. And the little money he has, he spent it on that evil girl. Where do you expect him to save money from? It's okay, my love. It's alright. Just can't put yourself together. It's alright. Everything will be fine. Just relax yourself. Good morning, beautiful. How was your night? Mine was wonderful with you by my side. Breakfast is ready. <laughs> yeah, baby. Full of surprises. Anything for you. All I want is for you to be happy all the days of your life. I 
You're sorry. What are you sorry about? My love, I know I shouldn't have raised my voice at you. I am deeply sorry, please. Listen, Leo. You can do anything, but not fool me. Even if you cheat, make it obvious, it is left for me to know if I will forgive you or not when I find out. Um, all right, my love. Um, my love, can I... Can I take you out for lunch? I already prepared a delicious meal here. I knew it. So tell me, what meal did you prepare? Don't be funny. You know I like intercontinental jello fries. It's okay, don't start. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. No, I said I'm sorry. You see, sometimes an aunt does not need to bite a man twice before he learns his lessons in life. You will go back to the city, get something else to sustain yourself. And let me add this. In everything, education is very important. Um, well, thank you very much, but I don't have any money with me to go back to the city, to start any business. I lost my job a few days ago. Hmm. It's all right. I will uh, give you the sum of 50,000 hmm? to go back to the city with. Hold on, I'm coming. I apologize, I'm yeah. sorry, but I know no waiting I do. Anything it be, I take for ground. I'm sorry, forgive me. Nothing I talk, they change your mind. Just got to how I love you, no tell me why. Before you go, there is one thing. For me, before you go, show me how to live without your love. That is the sum of 50,000 naira. Hmm? Go back to the city. Get something else doing to sustain yourself. Hmm. Uncle, thank you very much. Thank you so much. May God bless you. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Okay, I'll be going now. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Take care of yourself. Take care of yourself, okay? <laughs> this guy is so romantic. Oh my goodness. He treats me like an angel. He's so funny, so romantic. <laughs> Delia, did you hear what I said? What did you say that I haven't heard before? Delia, why are you behaving as if you're detecting my romantic choice? Don't I have the right to choose what makes me happy? Of course you do. But these are things I have heard before. There is no need listening to them, don't you think? Well, I know you don't like him, but sweetheart, it didn't change anything. <laughs> oh, Oscar, you so sweet. I brought you lunch. Oh. Please. Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you, darling. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Delia. Uh, you know, mature people lock their doors when they want to have some quickie or maybe use the toilet. Delia <laughs> should have at least knocked. <laughs> This is the file from the police station. Go through them and take the reports to boss. And 
Sometimes people mistake obsession for love. I'm sorry, maybe I'm talking too much. Excuse me. I'll go through it. Um, honey, I, I'll see you later after work. I'll come. Right. Take care of you. See ya. About what? On who to take seriously, the earring girl or me? My love, of course you know the answer to that. <laughs> no, I don't. Baby, you're my world best. Hmm? I cherish you so much, I know I love you with all my heart. Can you just answer the question already, Leo? It's simple. Whenever you call my name, I know you're really upset. Please calm down. I have a lot to do. Okay, my love, can you can you just forgive me? Forgive you for what exactly? Okay, fine. You'll just get a met at the gym yesterday and after the the gym we went swimming. Get out of my office. But I just said I said get out, Leo. My love. We can settle this. Do you want me to call the security? Please. Get out. My love, please. We can actually settle this. Leo, I, I, I want to repeat myself again. About your obsessed boyfriend, I presume. Why do you hate him so much? Do you have an eye on him? <coughs> Bella, come on. Don't be funny. You know how much I dislike flirts. If I want a man, I will get a real man and not some obsessed flirts. Excuse me. Just hope you don't have an eye for my man. Oscar, you scared me. 
scared me. Why didn't he come inside? Oscar, are you okay? What happened? Darling, please talk to me. What is the problem? You're getting me scared. Will you marry me? Yes, yes, I'll marry you. Thank you so much. You're so sweet. The sweeter. <laughs> I'll make this world the sweetest place for you. Thank you, sweetheart. You're welcome, hon. Can we go inside? Baby, let's celebrate next time. Five okay? minutes. I'm late for work. Please, five minutes. I won't take more than that. I need to, you see? I'll be. Okay. Very good for you. Baby. Yes. When are you taking me to see your mother, family? Not to worry, before the week runs out, I'll take you to see her. Okay. <laughs> By the way, you have not told me anything about your parents. I have. No, you haven't. Really? Yes. Okay then, my, my father died last year. Okay. Mom is a retired banker. I have a sister and a brother. Mm. <laughs> Tina is your sister. <coughs> oh, sorry, 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 take it easy, sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry. One more. Sorry. Are you okay now? Oh, yeah. <sighs> <laughs> it's mother. All right, it's mother. My love. So, what do you have to say? <laughs> I, 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 oh, you are short of words, right? Don't listen to me. I don't ever want to see you anywhere around me. Never. You could love with your new couch. No, no, please. Don't, don't do like that. I love you like this. Who is she? Who is she? My love, my everything. Baby, please forgive me. I am sorry. Please. Leo, can I ask you one question? Yes, you can. Is there anything you have asked of me that I failed to provide? No. Nothing at all. What I want from you is just your forgiveness. Do you remember what I told you in your house? My love, please. This is the last time. It will never happen again. It would never ever happen again. Please. Get out of my office. My love. Get out, else I will throw you out myself. My love, it has not come. Don't touch me! My love, please, let me just calm. We can actually settle this. Leo, we can, we can... If you don't get your filthy hands off me. You won't go back the same way you came here. Get out. Before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how to live without your love. I beg you, teach me how to live without your love. So before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how Teach me how to live without your love. 
My love, please forgive me. I knew I messed up but big time. Please. Can you remember how we started? I really want to help you. But you have to be honest with me. What? Did you collect any goods from Mr. Obi's sales manager, aside the one on the invoice? Yes, I did. So why then do you want to go to court? Listen, I would advise you to pay him back. Yeah, the truth is, I wish I could, but I, I don't have money now. Okay, I will give you the money. I mean, that man is too old to be dragged to court for his own goods. Really? Why are you doing all this? You shouldn't be asking me such questions. I'm so happy. And I want to say a big thank you for everything you've done for me. I sincerely appreciate it. God will pay you back promptly. Amen. And you're welcome. In case you don't mind, do you care if I take you out for lunch? Not today. Maybe some other time. I'm busy. All right. All right. Okay, my winner. All right. You have a nice day. Yeah, thank you. You too. Bye. Yes, Lizzie. Please get me the files on professional skills. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much for the lunch. You're welcome, my dear. You see, I could have done more if I had enough. Uh-huh. Yeah. So tell me, what else would you have done? I would have taken you to a Chinese restaurant or an expensive boutique in town. That's a show that I have for you. You know you're an honest man. And that has earned you my friendship. You can tell me whatever you want. I mean, you can visit me anytime you like. Wow. But first, I'll give you 500,000 Naira to support your business. 500,000 Naira? Mm -hmm. Like 500,000 Naira? Well, that's, that's, that's more than enough. <laughs> Thank you so much, my love. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so grateful. You're welcome. And is that all I get? Can't I get a peck? At least. Of course. Why not? <laughs> Even a kiss. Mm. <laughs> That's enough. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Since then, I have given you my all. Just to make you happy. And what did I get in return? Lies. Unfaithfulness. What did I do to you? My love, please. Okay, for the very last time, give me a second chance. I am, and please, the last and final time, please give me the third chance. There will never be us. Not even in the next life. Get out. <laughs> my love, you can't just go like that. You have to listen to me, please. My, my, my love, listen, listen to me. Okay, please, I, I, I am ready to, 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 to be a good man. I will not do it again. You haven't told me why you've been smiling since we got here. Guess. Can you ever guess? You have been reinstated? Oh? <laughs> oh! 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 I think I got it. <laughs> you found another love, right? No. Then what the hell is it? I did my matriculation last week. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Hold on. You're joking. You mean you got an admission into the university? Yes. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. It's okay. Oh my god. Yes, I got an admission to real estate management and urban planning. Oh, oh this is so good. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Um. 
This is the beginning of everything beautiful in your life. Congratulations once more. And maybe we should go somewhere to have some drinks, you know, pop some champagnes, at least to celebrate this good news. What do you think? Mm. Ah. Mm, okay, anywhere you take me to. Uh, okay, I think I know this beautiful place. I can take you to. Anyway, wherever you take me. <laughs> okay, um... Come, I know where to take you to. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> oh! Take it easy. Mm. Come in. Oh, baby. Look at you. <laughs> <laughs> Look ravish into the house. Really? Look at you. I always Look do, at baby. That. Look at that. <laughs> oh, welcome. Thank you. Sit down. So what's the secret of this uh, glow? Sweetie, I'm so happy today. Oh, what makes you happy? Tell me. I have a surprise for you. Whoa, what surprise is that? <laughs> eh? You know what? I think it's high time you want to see my people. What? Are you pregnant? Yes! <laughs> yes, baby. I am pregnant. I'm four weeks gone. <laughs> what? Are you not happy about it? I thought you were old enough to handle this. Handle what exactly? Do you expect me to take some pills after making love with my fiance? Oh my goodness. This is ridiculous. Excuse me. Babe, honey. I mean, wait, wait. Babe, baby. Wait. Babe, wait, wait, baby. Wait. Let me go. Let me go. No, can you just hear me out at least? What rubbish do you have to say to me? You don't want the pregnancy. No, I never said I didn't want the pregnancy. I, I was only shocked. Why would you be shocked that I'm carrying your baby? Sometime in the past, a, 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 a doctor once told me that I had low sperm count. I wouldn't be able to impregnate a woman. So when you said that, I, I was shocked. Excuse me. That is contrary to what you said inside. Goodbye. See, baby, see, see, please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? Come, let's go back. I'm happy. Look at me. <laughs> Look at me now. I'm happy. We're going to have a baby, you and I. Hey, this is trouble. She can't keep it, no. She has to abort it. She must abort it. I see. So, what do I prepare for dinner? Um, I'm, I'm not hungry yet. I'll, I'll let you know when I want to eat. Okay. Honey, I, I, I've been thinking about this and I think it's best you abort it. Why? I, I mean, I, I'm not ready for that now. You talk in a manner that leaves me wondering if you are still the man I fell in love with. For God's sake, you have a very good paying job. You can comfortably take care of this baby when it comes. We should be planning our wedding, not... You don't understand, babe. I'm not ready for marriage now, that's what I'm saying. It, it could come at any time, maybe this year, next year, some other time, but... I have a lot I'm doing at the moment. This is going to ruin a lot for me. Don't you get it? You are really out of your senses. I will not bought this baby. Oh yes. It is your child. And you will take full responsibility for it. Excuse me. What kind of a wahala is this? 
Chineke make this one no go dumb no no. What kind of a trouble is this? Open this thing, this girl, remove this thing now. Let everybody be in peace. What kind of a wahala is this? It's okay, just just calm down. Calm down. It's okay. How we do it? So now that you have succeeded in making me abort the baby, when are you going to see my people? As soon as possible, like I promised you. But before then, I'd like you to pick any city in the world. I want to take you on a holiday for a month. Are you serious? Yes. Oh, in that case, I want us to go to Paris. Paris? Paris is a beautiful city, you know. Yes. Okay, then we're going to Paris. What will happen is I'll just go tidy up the few government contracts I still have and then off we go. Really? You didn't tell me you have any government contracts. Oh, must have escaped my mind. I do have a couple of government contracts I have to tidy. Okay, so who is your legal assistant on mm, those contracts? My mother. Your mother? Mm-hmm. She told me your mother was a banker. Yes, actually, but she studied law in school. Uh, now she has decided to practice. Okay, I see. <laughs> I thought you had started lying. To How me. can I lie? <laughs> so I'll take you on Europe tour, yeah. Paris. Oh, babes, you're welcome. Welcome, Lydia. You took a sick leave, didn't you? You're welcome to Oscar. Thank you. There's food in the kitchen. So Paris, yes. Frankfurt, Paris, uh, Holland. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> you are just the best. <laughs> for one month rest. Oh yeah. Not just Paris. After Paris, we go to... Um, the Bella, other... Bella. Do you know the definition of common sense? <laughs> what does common sense have to do with what I just told you? Because in your case, it is uncommon. Oh, this man didn't have money to spend the rest of his life with you, but yeah, he has money to take you to Paris to rest for a month. Darling, by the time you wake up from this, it will be too late. Delia, I don't understand you. Why do you always think my brain is void of thinking? Because it is absolutely so. Yes, your brain is void of thinking. Girl, have you ever sat down to ask yourself if this man truly loves you? Oh yes, I know. I know he loves me. I love him too. Case closed. Hi, Jimmy. 
What about the pregnancy? You have aborted it, right? Bella, what is wrong with you? You aborted an innocent child and here you are excited about going to Paris to have a rest. You want to go and have a rest for killing an innocent child? Bravo! But darling, this is shameless. like this, what's wrong? We should have used condom. You're pregnant again? Yes. And I'm not going to abort it this time. Why can't you take precautionary measures? Why? Please, don't tell me that crap. Look, Bella. You're going to get rid of that thing. You want me to have a second abortion in one month? Hell no. For God's sake, we should plan to get married and raise a home. Listen to me, Bella. You cannot force or treat me into this. I won't do this with you. Not me, and not now. Get rid of that. You left a pregnancy pack that reads positive in the toilet. Bella, you're pregnant for him again. I apologize, I'm sorry, but I know no waiting I do. Anything it be, I take for granted, I'm sorry for <coughs> me. Nothing I thought. Shameless. Our love, you know, tell me why. Before you go, there is one. If it is about the pregnancy, I have made my stand clear. You are aborting it. I will not abort it. If you know you were not ready for it, why did you get between my legs? Oh, you now shout at me, is that it? You now raise your voice at me, Bella, that's it? No, 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 sweetheart, that's not it. I'm sorry, okay? I, I'm just upset. Sorry I raised my voice. If we are not getting married anytime soon, this pregnancy will bother me. Why will it bother you? It is not your first, is it? Oscar. Don't make me feel bad about in the first. She now calls me by my name, Oscar. I'm so, Oscar. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. Anyways, I have somewhere to go, and it's very important that I'm there at this time. If you want to wait, when I get back, we'll see. Please. Can I come with you? No, you can't. Now I know I was a fool. Thank you for breaking my heart. 
Are you still angry with me? Let's go inside. Thank you for breaking my heart. Why did you come in just like that? I should be asking you that. Who are you? Thank God you're Honey. here. <laughs> you didn't inform me you were coming to Nigeria today. And am I supposed to announce my arrival into my country? Who is she? Um, my cousin. Your cousin? Yes. And why is she dressed like this? Listen, I want you out of my house this minute. Um... Shut up. Get out. Oscar, you brought a female cousin that I do not know into our matrimonial home? Uh, she just came yesterday, you know. She, she came to take this uh, exam and, and, and then it got late. I can't leave my cousin to sleep on the streets now. What rubbish! What nonsense! And you see, it's, it's not a big deal. I'm just trying to be a good cousin. I, I... How can she enter Nigeria without telling me? How was the flight? Smooth. You should have informed me we're coming, so I'll come pick you at the airport. I'm home now. You know, I really did miss you. This room smells of cum. What? Honey, are you going to accuse me of cheating on you? And what can men not do? Do you think I trust you? Now that breaks my heart. A jealous wife has the right to say anything. Run to shop right and get me some moringa leaves. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll go right now. I'll be back in a jiffy. Bella, his cousin, and he watched her send me out of his house. Who could she be? His wife? Hell no. I can't imagine that. Dave, I'm, I'm, I'm deeply sorry, honestly. I'm deeply sorry about what just happened. She's my aunt, you. She's a very troublesome person. And she can be crazy because she takes heroin. And you could not defend your woman in front of your crazy aunt. What kind of a man are you? I am deeply sorry, honestly. I didn't want to create a scene. Do you know how, how irresponsible that woman is? Within that time, you left the house and now she has consumed four bottles of hot drink and two packets of cigarettes. As I was leaving the house, she's right now doing heroin and crack. Is that the person you want me to confront? How long is she going to stay in the house? She, she says you stay for as long as she's ready to go back to the States. You know what? 
I'm not coming to your house again until she leaves. No, don't say that. I'll talk to her. She might just want to see you when she's no longer high on drugs. Hell no! I like my life. Are you going to spend the night here? I would love to, you know that, but that woman is crazy. If I don't go back home, she might burn down my house. All right, love. You need to go home and keep her eye on her before she burns down your house. Yes, I will. Not to worry, I'll come see you tomorrow, okay? I'll be waiting. Love you. Love you too. Love you. <laughs> Sorry about that, okay? Let me run along before she burns down my house. All right, all right. I'll give you a call when I get Mommy, they are all for you. Chris, what? The what? Everything is for you. Hey! Tina! Tina! This is beautiful. I'm glad you like it. This is beautiful. With this? Yes, so. <laughs> Enjoy, mother. <laughs> ah! You see? This is why I always wait for you to return. Tina, you are the only daughter in law that takes good care of me. You only care about me. I will not care about you, Mom. I will. Uh, uh, uh. Mom. Oscar. You're here. I am here. See, all this for me. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> yes. Honey, whoa. She was asking after her car. And... The, the, the car is at the mechanic. Mechanic? Yes. The mechanic says it will be ready in the next two weeks. Honey, I bought you the Moringa leaves. Oscar, on a more serious note, where is my car? What's the meaning of that? Are you insinuating I could have sold your car? Oh now, that's an insult. Did that answer my question? Where is my car? Okay. I will take you to the mechanic so that you will see the car yourself. Tina, come down. Tina, 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 calm down. Eh? I'll tell you something later. I just hope my car is safe. You can't say, don't worry, what's going to happen to me? These beautiful things. Come on, I'm very glad you like the clothes. I the like car. them. Please take one. Take one from me! Thank you so much! You're welcome. I am not in the mood. Leave me alone. And it's been 15 months now. Oh yes. 15 months. 15 months I made the mistake of leaving you here in Nigeria to be messing around with all these girls. Are we going to start talking about that again now? I want my car back in this house. First thing tomorrow morning. The amount the mechanic is calling is too high. And how much is that that we can't afford? 50,000 Naira. Can you imagine that? Just to change brake pads. That boy is wicked. Oscar, you lie a lot these days. 50,000, right? I will give it to you tomorrow morning. Oscar, we are going to the mechanic this morning. The mechanic? Why? Oh, to, to get the car. Not to worry, when I'm done washing the other car, I'll no, 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 Oscar, no. You are taking me to the mechanic today. Because I don't get it. I am sick and tired of hearing your stupid excuses. We are going there together. No, honey. It's not, I'm not giving excuses. I'm telling you the truth. It will only take me a moment to walk down the street to go get the car. You don't have to bother about that. Trust me. Mm. Very well then. Go. Go get the car. Let's see how it goes. 
نعم نعم اوكي نعم نعم Oscar, I am giving you five minutes. Five minutes to bring that car to this house today. Okay, let me change it to something better. Be husband thief. How could you badge into my office premises to assault me? Have you gone nuts? I can sue you. You have no shame at all. Excuse me. Excuse you? I should excuse, excuse you. Now let me have the car keys. What car key exactly? Have you gone nuts? What is going on? Here? Mother, what why why look at these this? girls of these days? How could you put asunder? What God has put together? Eh? You even dared to ask a question. Kaki? No! Shrelaki! Shrenki! Will you give her that key now, you husband snatcher? What keys exactly? Are you asking me that silly question? Let me have the car keys! Now listen and listen, God. This is the last warning I am going to give to you. Stay away from my husband! The next time I come here, <laughs> You wouldn't leave with your face like this. You hear her? Excuse me! You hear her? No, 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 no. You didn't really hear her. Because by the time she's done with you, I'll put those pieces together and set them ablaze. Yes. So stop sleeping with her husband. Because it is evil to sleep with people's husbands. Do you know what you are? Ash. You want me to complete it? What? Then put it two together. Nonsense. What is going on? I don't know. It's as if I'm dreaming or in the movies. I, I, I don't know what is Jamie, going on. Who is she? What happened? Do you do this to me? Do what to you? Oscar. So you're married? What? Oh, Oscar, you're married. We, he, no. He's married? No, see, there, there, there's a mix-up somewhere. I, I can explain these things. It's not, it's not what you think. Oscar, you're married. No. I... <laughs> Let me see. I... Don't ah, touch me! Don't you dare touch me again! How could you do this to me? Oh, oh my God! Oh no, 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 no! See, this is Dalia. See, just shut up. <laughs> no, it's not okay, Dalia. It's not okay. I'll be stupid. Just shut up! <laughs> What's could... wrong with you? How could Oscar do this to me? How could he? Yeah, you will talk about this when you get home. Just don't do this on TV. Please. It's okay. It's okay. Just put yourself together. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Can you just get lost already? I want to console her. What? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oscar, and what are you still doing here? What are you still doing here? My friend, get into the car. Let's go. Get into the car now. I said, get into the car. Hey. 
have been fooling around. And let's go. Bella, truth be told, I don't feel sorry for you at all. I mean, I warned you when this whole thing started, but no. It felt like Delia was delving into your affairs. I am shattered. I am shattered. I can... I can never be fine again. It's okay. It's okay. It's fine. You will be fine. At least you have learned your lessons. Not all the glitters are good. Just take things easy, please. I need to go to bed. You still feel your love was real. Now I know I was your fool. yourself because of Oscar, a married man. Really? Dylan, you won't understand. <laughs> I've been stupid. I am stupid. <laughs> stupid. You have to eat. I understand, but you have to calm down. You really have to take things easy. Please. I'm off to work. I need you to be good. Okay? And please, just take good care of yourself until I come back. Please. Okay. Well, I can't continue like this. I need to go to work. Please, don't have another drink. I'll see you when I'm back. And don't take another bottle from the sitting room, please. your head when you get there. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Bella. Yes. <laughs> Is she the one? Oh, yes. Uh, Bella, sir. meet my son, Austin. He's a pilot. It's a pleasure to meet you, sir. Pleasure's mine. Dad. She's beautiful. You're beautiful. You know what, Dad? I'm taking her right away on a date. Special date. <laughs> Go ahead. Shall we? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. <laughs> Excuse me. Go on. There. You. <laughs> Dad told me a lot about you. <laughs> Honestly, I never knew he had a son who is a pilot. 
do you mind if I tell you that today I realize what love at first sight means? No, oh, please. Please, don't scare me. Men have dealt with me. I am not like the other men. That is what every man say. At the end, he becomes worse. Then, I will prove you wrong. Can we have our drink in peace, Mr. Pilot? <laughs> Sure, sure, sure. <laughs> yes. <laughs> ah. Take me to work. <laughs> of course, I'm a pilot, and that's why I've come to pilot you to your working place. See. Shall we? <laughs> you have your father's common smile and sense of humor. One more secret. Being romantic is part of our nature. Shall we? Maybe I should help you take this one. No. Thank you. You're welcome, darling. You know you're different in a romantic way. <laughs> oh! <laughs> did I just say that? Oh, yes, I did. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, I haven't felt like this in a while now. Yeah. I'm here to make you feel very special, darling. That is, if you give me the chance to do so. Thank you. Thank you. I want to take you out for lunch. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> so shall we? to drop the fan. Okay then. Nice day. So, so, <laughs> shall we? Okay. Yeah, sure. All right. Let me, just give me some time to run off. It's okay. Take all the time. <laughs> Thank you. All right then. <laughs> oh.
He's so cute. And he's a pilot. <laughs> My goodness, I hope I'm not going into this again. You're not saying anything. What? What did I hear you say? You want me to tell you to be careful when I know that you have already fallen head over heels in love with this man. Baby, you're old enough to know what you want. I won't be advising a woman who just got fooled a few weeks ago and suddenly she is in love. Hell no, I wouldn't do that. Mm. You see, Delia, that is your problem. You think because you don't have a man, every other girl should stay without a man. Hell no. Point of correction, darling. You know my status. You know the kind of family I come from. If I wanted any man, I would have gotten any man of my choice with just a snap of my finger. But hell no. I am very focused. Mm. I know what I want. I do my things at the right time. I don't go around seeking for solace and emotions from men. I am not some sort of vulnerable woman. I am not vulnerable. Well, heaven knows you know what you are. Whatever. take a bath first. Don't worry, sweetie. I know what I want, okay? <laughs> Cold outburst of emotions. It happens to me too. But it's made me appear cheap. Shh. Don't say that again. You're not cheap. But what if I get pregnant? What makes you think I cannot take care of pregnancy? That's not what I'm saying, exactly. It is not a mistake. Stop feeling guilty. We're adults, you know. Ain't we? Ain't we adults? This is so nice. Wonderful. 
who is getting married. Will you? Will you marry me? Oh my goodness! Ah, yes! Oh yes, I'll marry you! Oh my goodness, I, I didn't even know! I am the one. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> that was awesome. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Dad. Thank, thank you, Dad. Thank you, Dad. Thank you. Wow. Wonderful. Yes. <laughs> Bella. Sir. Now you have to cut the engagement cake. Oh, yes. no yes. pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> Our son, you have to support her. Definitely, good. Yeah, definitely, yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited. Yeah, yes. Yes. Go ahead. <laughs> now I'm going to spare love. Yes. Love. Yeah? For you to cut the cake. Okay. L. O. V. N. E. <laughs> Congrats. Oh, Congrats. Ooh. <laughs> <Congrats>. <laughs> it's time for lunch. I did it. I did it. Get the dining ready. Yes, sir. Okay. Good. Because <laughs> I'm famished. Oh, Dad. <laughs> are we not forgetting something? Why are we forgetting that? The dogs. And so, girl, you should be happy for me. Mm -hmm. I should be happy for you. Oh, Cass. Oh, come on. <laughs> Just two weeks ago, I was happy when Oscar proposed. Mm -hmm. Delia, don't be ridiculous. Oscar is in the past. He's a mystic that I don't want to remember. Oh. I see. Have you told him that you're carrying another man's child? Girl, you are evil. You're such a killjoy.
Come to think of it, she's right. What will happen if Austin finds out that I'm carrying another man's baby? I don't want to lose him. As I was saying, okay. next week, we're going to see your parents for marriage preparations. You don't say. <laughs> oh my goodness. You're such a darling. You too. Thank you. You're welcome. I love you. I can't wait. Love you so much. I love you more. Take this. <laughs> <laughs> Sister, welcome. Thank you. <laughs> My son, you are welcome. Yeah, thank you very much, Ma. No, Ma. No, Ma. Ma, let me go inside and get all that soup with fufu for you. Eh? Mm. Mama, chelo, chelo, chelo. Now your ora soup can wait. I know that they the good and they prepare ora soup, but wait. <laughs> oh, let me introduce our guests to you. <laughs> His name is Austin. He's my august son, my boss in the office. This is his son. He's also a pilot. Mm. Yes. We are planning to get married. Yes. <laughs> You're welcome. All right, thank you, Mo. Mm -hmm. I am beginning to think that education has turned into something else. Just last month you came here with a man called Oscar. That you two were getting married. Now it's Austin. What type of a woman are you? Mama, I left Oscar because he was not honest. Then this person you brought now, how long have you known him to know if he is honest or not? Oh, please, Mama. I'm not a little girl. But you're behaving like one. Eh? Wait a minute. Mama, what is it? Oh, oh, is this the reason for the urgent marriage? So you're pregnant already, Mama? Mama, 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 Mama you're shouting. You're stop, stop shouting. Chena, okay? Oh, I am shouting. Eh? So you're pregnant? Please, please, please. I'm not here for this. I came to tell you that Austin and his people will be coming on Saturday to pay my bread price. Please help me tell Uncle Amazon. I will send you money tomorrow for preparation. Excuse me. Hey, hey, hey. Bella! Hey. Honey? Yeah? Let's go. Why? No problem. Just let's just go, okay? Let's go. Girl, <laughs> we're planning our wedding. So, <laughs> I'm so happy. So, would you be my chief bridesmaid or should I look for someone else? Bella, why are you acting like you are in some kind of rivalry or something? I asked you a simple question. Would you or would you not? Bella. Would you stop acting like a child, please? I guess the answer is no. Good. Fine. Ooh. My hubby's coming. My husband's coming. Hey, hubby. <laughs> I'm fine, thank you. Oh, okay. I'll be right there. Let me just change into something better. Okay, baby. I love you. <laughs> okay. Time to go. My husband.
название старый. Excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? There's an emergency. You see, I was called as one of the pilots traveling today to Libya to rescue some Nigerians over there. <laughs> How long would that take? Um, I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> what happens to the wedding? I'm not going to die there. As soon as I come back, we'll begin with the wedding plan. Honey, come on, calm down. Okay, calm down, calm down. I understand how you feel. Everything will be okay. Well, you can stay with my dad till I come back. What do you think? Don't stay with you, don't stay with you. Mommy, <laughs> come on. <laughs> I understand, okay, I'll be back soon, eh? Soon, 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 I'll be back. At least a smile. I'm trying. I'm trying. I thank God for everything. And I just want to say thank you for the provisions. Oh, come on. Don't mention. You said that already upstairs. It's <laughs> fine. Okay, thank you. You know, I actually, the noise in this hostel, you know, it's not allowing someone to concentrate. <laughs> but I'm, I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying. I know it's on you to you, but not <laughs> okay. to worry. You'll be fine. It's, it's okay. always like that. It's hmm? okay. I heard Bella is getting married. Yeah. So she said, can we go somewhere and talk? Maybe a restaurant or a bar? Okay. All right, let's go. My car is over there. Ah, you have a car now? Well, yes, I always had a car. Eh, but... eh, eh, Charlie, Charlie, I beg off my stove for me. I beg, I beg, I beg. You go to the bone now, I beg. Thank you. You have a car now? I've always had a car. It's been parked in my family house. Wow. Nice one. Let's okay. go. Yes. And you're in the me. What about oh, you? you. No. <laughs> Please wake up. What is it? I am worried. <sighs> Bella, you know I had a hectic day at work. Can we have this talk tomorrow morning, please? Listen. We do not. Austin will be out of town for God knows when. And for Christ's sake, what has that got to do with me sleeping? Yes. You wanted to hang the pregnancy on his neck. What do I do? Let me sleep. Please. Go and fix your mess. 
before you go Show me how to live without your love I beg you Teach me how to live without your love To jump on the hand of me To sleep on the hand of me You must teach me Cause I don't know how to live without your love Come in, come in. heard from Austin in two weeks. <laughs> Is that why it's bothering you? They went for another assignment in South Sudan. And not to worry. Hmm? They'll be back by next month. Next month? Uh, yeah, I know. I know you are terribly missing him. Hmm? See, if you need anything, just come to me. Okay? So I don't need anything. I want my Austin. Yeah. <laughs> okay, sir. Let me go back to work. It's all right. Sir. No one ten ten. So if you have a domestic staff that's taking good care of you. Ah, come on. I don't see that. All right, Dad, Dad. Ah, man. Wow. It's been a while. I need to go and see Bella. I've really offended her greatly. I need to go and see her as it is. Austin. Yes, Dad. You never told me that she was pregnant. Pregnant? Bella pregnant? Dead. I don't understand. Don't tell me that you're not aware that she's pregnant. You getting me more confused, Dad? I don't know what you're talking about. You can't be confused. You can only be confused if you didn't touch her. I said it to be a surprise. Yes. I'm so sorry. We are going to see our family doctor. What? Why? Oh. You think this pregnancy is not yours? You think I'm carrying another man's...
Why is your face like this? What's wrong? We should have used condom. You're pregnant again? Yes. And I'm not going to abort it this time. Why can't you take precautionary measures? Why? Please, don't tell me that crap. Look, Bella. You're going to get rid of that thing. You want me to have a second abortion in one month? Hell no. For God's sake, we should plan to get married and raise a home. Listen to me, Bella. You cannot force or trick me into this. I won't do this with you. Not me, and not now. Get rid of that. We need to talk now. If it's about the pregnancy, I have made my stand clear. You are aborting it. I would not abort it. If you know you were not ready for it, why did you get between my legs? Oh, you now shout at me, is that it? You now raise your voice at me, Bella, that's it? No, 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 sweetheart, that's not it. I'm sorry, okay? I, I'm just upset. Sorry I raised my voice. If we're not getting married anytime soon, this pregnancy will bother me. Why will it bother you? It is not your first, is it? Oscar, don't make me feel bad about aborting the first. She now calls me by my name, Oscar. I'm so, Oscar. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Please. Anyways, I have somewhere to go, and it's very important that I'm there at this time. If you want to wait, when I get back, we'll see. Please. Can I come with you? No, they change your mind, you scared the hour of love, you know, tell me why. Before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how to live without your love. I beg you, teach me how to live without your love. To jump on the hand of me, oh. to sleep on the hand of me, oh. you must teach me, cause I don't know how to live. Without your love, baby, don't go. Show me how to live without your love. Leave me, I die. Teach me how to live without your love. To jump on the hand of me, oh. To sleep on the hand of me, oh. You must teach me, cause I don't know how to live without your love. Austin, has Bella not picked yet? Dead. She hasn't picked my call. I don't understand. Why don't you go to her house? They have been to her house. I've been there. I knocked severally, but she refused to open the door for me. Dad, I'm confused. I feel guilty as it is. Okay. Don't worry. There are many ways to kill a bird. Many ways to kill a bird? This bird has refused to perish. To live without your love Cause I don't know how to live without your love Never pick your call, pick your call I'm sorry lady I should have thought of a way to make up for the long distance I created between us It's okay. Get up. Thank you. Oh. Let me get you something to eat. No, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. Maybe later. We need to go and see my parish priest for our bounds of marriage. Okay. In that case, let me change into something better. It's okay. Oh, good day, brother. <laughs> Austin, good day, father. How are you? Very well, father. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, father. Austin, sir, you here to see me? Yes, father. We're here to see you over our marriage band. Austin, your father called me a few minutes ago. Okay. 
go home. Excuse me. Son, yes, Dad. Please excuse us. <sighs> Bella, sir. I know you will not lie to me. Would you? Start talking. I'm so sorry, sir. Sir, please, I'm so sorry. I am terribly disappointed in you. Listen, son. Over the years, this family has been positively acknowledged for its good moral standards. This is because we have meticulously guarded against incursion of any negatively disposed gene into the blood of this family. So I cannot be alive and watch her bring disrepute to this noble family. Baby, please. I am so sorry. Please. Where did I go wrong? Tell me, where did I go wrong? Loving you right? No. No, please. You don't deserve this. I am so sorry, Austin. You don't deserve this. Please forgive me. I will put my life to make things right. Please. I am so sorry, please. You, you are Carlos. You are heartless. Don't. Please. I'm sorry. Excuse me. Please. I apologize, I'm sorry, but I know no waiting I do. Anything they be, I take for ground. I'm sorry, forgive me. Nothing I talk, they change your mind. Just got the hour love you, don't tell me why. Before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how to live without your love. I beg you.
teach me how to live without your love To jump on the hand of me, uh, to sleep on the hand of me uh, You must teach me cause I don't know how to live without you Um, the intake of the poison has affected you. Jesus Christ. Doctor, what can we do to save her life? Um, the only option is uh, in trioterial fetal death. Doctor, please. Just do anything. Anything you can to save her life, please. Excuse me. Can I get you something to eat? Come on, Bella. You've been like this since morning. Delia, please. Allow me to mourn my stupidity. Stupidity? <laughs> now listen to me, Bella. Let it be stupidity if you say it is. But let me tell you something. Don't you think karma has come to repay you? Dear, please. Please, I'm heartbroken. Please. Well, sorry. <laughs> Bella. Sir. Do you think I'm going to dismiss you? Please go back to your work. Thank you, sir. around the world and now yeah yeah but i'm back now you know oh my goodness <laughs> but you you know you're not nice i mean you just graduated and vanished into thin air without oh. even letting me know where you were i'm That's so sorry fair. i'm so sorry for that okay see we have a lot to talk about oh really yeah so where do we sit and talk um there's this new joint in town i mean we can hang out there well, I don't hang out. I go on dates. You're so, you're so funny. You never change. <laughs> yeah, right. I know I am funny. So, um, let's go. I'm ready. Okay. Okay. You made me cry, but I never knew I would find someone much better than you. Thank you for breaking my heart. I used to feel your love was real. I've been in the West, you know, trying to be a man. You know, I actually engaged myself in a series of um, businesses oh. and projects, you know. 
Right now I have a few hotels. Yes, I mean, and some restaurants, including this one. You're kidding me, Ernest. I know. I just bought it for people last week. You're not serious, are you? No, I'm serious. That's great. I've always known that you would be great. I'm proud of you. Thank you very much. Um, what about Bella? Well, Bella is fine. She's getting married next weekend. Mm, good news. To Oscar? I mean, since then? Mm, no, <laughs> no. Oscar is past tense. She's getting married to a guy called Dominic. That's nice. Anyway, I wish her luck. Me too. <laughs> well, I think we should drink up. Cheers. To good life. Good life. Welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> gotten a man for yourself. I hope he's not a married man because you are so addicted to married men. Excuse me. That's my fiance you're talking to like that. Mm. Sometimes she almost snatched my husband from me. You can ask my husband. Can you stop this honey? Stop what baby? I need to tell people like her to stop sleeping with married men. That woman. Let's go. I want to know who that woman is and what she's talking about. Do you want to embarrass me here too? Is that what you want? Excuse me. Baby, please don't be like this. Are you going to allow what that woman said at the supermarket to ruin our love? Our wedding is on Saturday and the devil has come with his problems. Now tell me, what did the devil do? Did he send you to go and sleep with another woman's husband? Did he? Baby, baby, please. Look at what you're saying to me. Don't you know me again? Don't you trust me? I can't do such a thing. You didn't take a, a jockey. Oh yes. She doesn't know what she's saying. Please, my love. I love you so much, please. very proud of you. Well, truth be told, I don't have a boyfriend. Yes, I am not lucky with men. I mean, most of them just started coming for me when they realized the daughter of whom I am. I hope I'm not going to be seen as such. 
Not at all. I mean, you are special. Kind of. <laughs> so tell me, what do I offer you? I have fruit salad, I have smoothie. No, I have to come back tomorrow for that. Mm? Oh. Yeah, I want to go to Samson's Lane to see my contractor. What? I will see you tomorrow. So I say thank you for breaking my heart. Thank you for saying goodbye. You made me cry, but I never knew I would find someone much better than you. Thank you for breaking my heart. Thank you. Isabella, what is going on? Eh? Where is your husband? I don't know why he's taking time. I don't. Do, do you know what? Calm down. Just take it easy. Calm down. How can I calm down when I can't even see any of his relatives? Not his mom, his dad, even his brothers. How can I calm down? Listen, I, I think you should call him on the phone. Yeah. Try to get him on the phone. What did he say? Hey, where are you going? Listen, I still do not understand what is going on here. Where is your husband and why is the wedding that is supposed to hold today not holding? Uncle Storm! Bella, what did he... Bella, wait. Don't do this. Just wait. What is wrong with you? What are you doing? This is what happened. What happened? I don't understand what is this open injury. What do you mean? Stop. I left the village for her wedding. Only to come here and the wedding did not hold. And to make matters worse, I'm hungry. Isn't that the height of insolence and nonchalance? But I'm out of this place. You can go, Amase. Amase, you can go. Stand there. Please stop her. Okay, you still haven't answered my question. I am yet to understand what is going on. Why did the young man call off the wedding? Bella, you I'm waiting to... for an answer. Uncle, please now, please. What is this? I should please. Now, uh, tell me, tell me, because I, I think uh, something is really going on. You're hiding something. Didn't you people cook? Because I'm hungry. You didn't give me food. Yes. Maybe this action of yours is deliberate. You, you didn't cook. Eh? If you didn't cook, tell me. I will understand and go home honorably. You can go home. I can go. I must say, go home. Go. Okay. I will go to the village and tell them how it all happened. Hmm? Bella, please stop crying now. Please. You can't continue like this. Listen. You go through this. It's, it's okay. Bella. Bella, please. Okay, let's go home. Bella. Mm. Bella. No, it's okay. Bella. It's alright. This is not the end of your life. Rather, this is the beginning of your new dawn. Come well, let's go. Bella, please. I apologize, I'm sorry. 
me, but I know no waiting I do. Anything it be, I take for ground. I'm sorry, forgive me. Nothing I talk, they change your mind. You scatter, I will love you, don't tell me why. Before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how to live without your love. I beg you. Stop doing this to yourself. Please. What am I doing to myself? Where am I going to? Sister, come, let's go back home. Let us go back home, please. This, this is lovely. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> now, today is your special day. I want you to make a request and I'll grant it. Um, what do I want? What do I want? Okay, yes. I want to go to the cinema. I want to see Black Panther. Is that all? Yes, that's all. Then go get prepared. Let's go watch Black Panther. Oh, <laughs> thank you very much. Right. Please sit down. Um, I'll be with you soon. Let me just change okay. something better. A nice movie. Yeah. Cheers. You know, oh. I would love to watch such a movie. Tell me. More and more and more again. <laughs> well, the message is simple. Yeah. It shows that we still have black superheroes. Mm. Um. Daniel. I'll be nervous. Yes, you have. And you were sleeping here tonight. Thank you for breaking my heart. Thank you for Come saying on. goodbye. You made me cry, but I never knew I would find someone much better than you. Thank you for breaking my heart. Good morning. 
what is it? Sir. Why didn't you touch me last night? Dalia. You are special. And special women are rare. And when you see them, you respect them. You always have your way with words. Come take me to the office. Okay. Thank you for breaking my heart. Thank you for saying goodbye. You made me cry, but I never knew I would find someone much better than you. Thank you for breaking my heart. Yes. I will see you soon. What do you mean you'll see me soon? I'll see you this evening. Okay, no problem. <laughs> Have a nice day. Bye. Bye. Now you're sorry and you feel with shame. So I say thank you for breaking my heart. Thank you for seeing. I'm so sorry to ask, as if I'm not saying very well. Is that not Chuma? Yes, um, that's Chuma. He is now a multi-millionaire. Have a nice day. Thank you for breaking my heart. Thank you for saying goodbye. You made me cry, but I never knew I would find someone. Darling. Yeah, sure. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Darling. Will you marry me? Yeah, who's there? Come in. Dalia. Yes. Will you marry me? Yes, I will. No woman in her right senses will reject your proposal. I'll marry you today, tomorrow and forever. Thank you. Oh my God. Thank you so much. Thank you. He's made me the happiest man on earth. <laughs> made my day, I'm so happy. I'm happy too. Thank you. Wow. Oh, this is, this is <laughs> amazing. It's beautiful. Although it's a little bit big, but I like it. <laughs> Thank you. Came into town and you never bothered to check on me. You just engaged my best friend before me. How wicked can you be, Juma? Be 
Bella. I am the same vomit we covered with sand five years ago. How is it going to sound to you? Do you know what? We never broke up. Really? But we didn't, right? Yes. I, 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 I just wanted a break. We, we didn't uh, break and, up. And you think you're not done with the break? Is that what you're thinking? Oh, come on, Bella. Come on, come on. Don't just... Don't remind me of all those nightmares, all those sleepless nights. Please, do not remind me that. Please. Um, um, I'm sorry, anyway, I, I still yeah, love you, Jim. I, I, I need still to show you something. You. Ah, you're full of surprises. <laughs> come on, come on. I need to show you something, okay? All right. Um, just lock up my door and drop the keys on the gates, man. Let's go. Juma. Let's go. Juma. 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 Thank you for breaking my heart. Thank you for saying goodbye. You made me cry, but I never knew I would find someone much better. Yes, Chuma. Bella, I lost my boss yesterday. Sorry about that. Just that? You don't care to know why the company collected the boss from me? Will you bring the boss back? He just heard me say, I'm sorry about that. Bella, you're talking to me. Oh. What do you want me to do? Start shedding tears because the company collected their boss? Bella, this boss we are talking about fed us and provided for us for six years. You see? I said it. That is why it is very, very bad to deal with illiterates like you. Must you remind me that that boss fed me for six years? Must you? Baby, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I reacted that way. Yeah? I am not surprised that you overreacted. That is what people of no class, illiterates, that is how they react. Excuse me. I apologize, I'm sorry, but I know no what I do. Anything it be, I did for ground, I'm sorry, forgive me. Nothing I talk, they change your mind. You scatter our love, you know, tell me why. Before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how to live without your love. Chuma, what are you still doing here? Oh, okay. You want my neighbors to think I locked you outside, right? Bella, do you know I lost my job yesterday? And I need you to console me. I haven't been paid for... For like a month now. Mm, okay. I, 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 and I have not eaten anything since since yesterday. Uh, now, what do you want me to do? Bella, do you have food in the house? I, 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 I let me just. Here, go out there and get yourself some food to eat. Okay? I'm late for work. Bella, what is this? You now have a car you never care to tell me. I don't have to blow my I'm sorry, but I know no waiting I do. Anything it be, I take for ground. I'm sorry, forgive me. Nothing I talk, they change your mind. You scatter our love, you know, tell me why. Before you go, there is one thing. I mean, how do you think that a lawyer like me 
will settle for an illiterate bus driver like you. Hell no. <laughs> eh? Bella, you said this to me. Oh, please. A man that fed you. A man that gave you life. You gave me life? How? Are you the only person that trained someone in the university before? Are you? See, at times you need to talk with your senses. You're just an illiterate. Bella, me, illiterate. You called me an illiterate. I advise you go look for your class, okay? Please, stop bugging me. Bella, it's okay, but it's very unfair. It's very, very unfair. Have a nice day. No problem. Before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how to live without your love. I beg you, teach me how to live without your love. Yes, for me. To jump with the hand of me, uh, to sleep with the hand of me, uh, you must teach me, cause I don't know how to live without your love. Chuma. Mm -hmm. What are you doing here? Why are you kneeling? What are you doing? Baby, I can't... I can't breathe very well. I've, I've, I've searched my heart very well, but... I couldn't find where I've wronged you. Chuma, please, get up and leave. You're embarrassing me in my office. Please leave. Baby, do you, do you want to kill me? Do you, do you want me to die? Okay, if you want to die, fine. But go to your house. Go home and die, okay? Please, Chuma, Chuma, please. Don't force me to call the security on you. Please. Am I interrupting some? Oh, no, darling. You're not interrupting anything. Just some illiterate nuisance that do not know that this is an office. Bella, that's too harsh. Dahlia, please. Please help me talk to her. Please. Tell you, I am I am I am I am shattered. I'm shattered. Chuma, it's okay, just stand up. No, no, don't get up. Stay there and be mewing like a cat. Don't leave. Get out. Go, go, go. Fine. That's the file of the 13 years old girl that was raped at the Baba shop. Take a look at it. Okay, fine, but just get him out of here, please. Mm. Chuma. Can I have a word with you, please? Let's go. Nothing I talk, they change your mind. Just get down, I will love you, no tell me why. Before you go, there is one thing you must do for me. Before you go, show me how to live without your love. I beg you, teach me how to live without your love. To jump with the hand of me, oh. To sleep with the hand of me, oh. You must teach me, cause I don't know how to live without your love. Baby, don't go. Show me how to live without your love. Hey! Hey! What am I seeing? Brother! Oh, yeah, come now. Come on, man. Come on, come. Hey! How are you? Brother, you're looking so good. God has blessed me. Uh, yes. Uh, is this your car? This is one of my cars. One of? Hey! Jelu, huh? Jelu, brother, you mean you have many cars? Yes. <laughs> I drive one. Hey! You know? Yes, I'm a boy. You know? Yes, I'm a boy. You know what I mean? Hey! I made a rasu. Hey, Jaro, I see if I knew you were coming. Yes, sir. Hey! Hey, ah. you need to give something. Yes, I will, Mama. Um, get down the things from the boat. Okay, brother. People, you, 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 me, let me go and save you. I'll save you myself, eh? It's okay. I'm pretending. Hey! Okay. <laughs> Mama, not Hey. You go and thank your uncle. You have been very kind to us. I will go and see him. Meanwhile. Meanwhile, I came to talk to both of you. The only thing I want to hear now is that you are getting married. And my admission too, but I want to go to school. Don't worry, I'm preparing something for you. Hmm? I'm gonna get you, go to London, 
When you get there, you start schooling there. You see, in life I've come to a point to realize that it's all about forgiveness. And now that I want to settle down, I have to settle down with Bella. Settle with who? Bella. Bella what? Over my dead body, brother. Brachuma, over my dead body. Did you hear what I said? Over my dead body, will I allow this happen? It's not done, my son. It's not done anywhere. Uh, these children. It's not done, my son. It's not done. See, I will never let it happen. I will never let Chuma marry that girl. She can never be a part of my family. She can't. Ego, my love. I am still surprised. Yes. I don't understand why your brother will go back to a girl that made him pass through hell. I don't know. He still wants to go and marry her. Hmm. I think there's something wrong somewhere. That girl has gone spiritual. Eh? Yes. Is it spiritual? See, let me tell you to tell her, in case you know her, that her spirituality has failed. You see that her juju? It has failed. It is okay. Where, it's where was she? When my brother Chuma was going through hell. It's okay, my love. Calm down, okay? Relax. Don't tell me to relax. Don't tell me to relax. I, you don't need to tear yourself up. I will come and talk sense into him. Just relax yourself. You better do that, though. Okay. You better talk to Chuma. It's okay. I have a smile for me. It's all right. Leave me alone. Baby, it's your love. Oh, oh believe me alone. Why is your face like this? What's the problem? Is it not Chuma? No, Chuma wants to kill me. Chuma? Hmm. Is he back? He's back in nine. And he's even planning to marry that evil girl. Hey. It's okay. Come with me. Let us go to the house and sit down and talk. Okay, ma. Man, can I marry Simu? The most painful one is that this same girl is the girl that left him for another man when he had nothing. Shuma cannot be so stupid. Where is he now? He's at home. He's all right. You can go home, huh? Okay, nice. I'll be coming to talk to him. I'm grateful. Thank you very much. Thank you. Let You're me welcome. be going, eh? You're welcome. Thank you very much. Oh, bye bye. Take care of yourself. Okay, you too. Uh -huh. <sighs> Children of nowadays. Go and tell him I am here to see him. He should be able to listen to me. I press online. Yes. <clears throat> Uncle? He's not inside though. Back here and check on me. You should be there. <laughs> Bro, Chuma. Uncle Agumba wants to see
Ego. Uncle. Did you not tell him that I'm, wait, I'm waiting here for him? <laughs> Uncle, I told him you were calling him. But he refused to say anything. I cannot drag him. You will go back now and tell him that I am waiting here to talk to him. As a matter of fact, let us, let, yeah. let us go. Let me talk to you guys. Stop one boy. Where is he? He was sitting here. Try the door. Rachuma, open the door. Oh, so, Chuma, so it has got you to the point of you locking yourself inside the house without wanting to talk to me? What is this that I'm hearing? Do I look like a child to you? That you have to query me on the road? Um, I was going to talk to you as a family. Give family. your family talk to yourself. Chuma! Chuma! So you heard I was around to talk to you and you left the house? Uncle, that's not what happened. Then what happened? Did you not hear my voice? Uncle, I went inside to do divine mercy prayer. When I came out, you were gone. Shuma, what did that girl give to you? Uncle, if you will listen, I will tell you what I want to tell my mother. But she refused to listen. Let me not hear stories that sound pleasing to the ears that I should follow you to go and marry that girl. Uncle, I thought I played with you to listen to me. Okay. Talk. Okay. For years now, I find it very difficult to forgive Bella. But now I want to settle down. I will want all of you to forgive her. As I do. Forgive her so that you can marry her. So we can be free from sin of hate and unforgiving spirit. And? And I'll bring the woman I want to marry for all of you to see. Is she not the woman you want to marry? No, Uncle, no. <laughs> now you are talking. <laughs> you should have told your mother the same thing. But she refused to listen to me. That's okay. That's all right. Tell her I, will, I want to see her. Hmm? Ah, no. I will go with you immediately. It's okay. Yes. It's okay. Let us go. Yeah. <laughs> it's better I end it all. <laughs> I will never be alive to see Chuma bring that girl into this house. <laughs> Over my dead body, should I allow that to happen? Mama! Is that the end? Mama! Let me end it now! Mama! Mama! Mama, what are you trying to do? Leave me! Leave me! Leave me! Leave me! Leave me! <laughs> you know I suffered for you. I suffered for you. It's okay, Mama. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. So that was what I wanted to say. She go straight to the front. <clears throat> Um, Brachuma, as for me, I am okay. As long as you're not bringing that 
What's her name again? Bella or Bole. Inside this house as your wife. I am very happy with you. He's talking about forgiveness. I am forgiving her. Me too. Because if she didn't act the way she did, you wouldn't have made it in this life. Well, you are correct. But that is by the way. Uh, Shuma. We need to talk at home or signing with me at the Obi came to me to tell me that uh, he's interested in marrying Ego before he travels abroad for his studies. Uncle. Well, that was supposed to be a surprise now. But I don't like surprises. <laughs> oh, it's okay. Let me get you something to drink. Okay. <laughs> um, Uncle. I'm here to thank you for everything you've done for me. Oh, I appreciate everything. Okay? I am going to build you a new house and get you a new car. Me? <laughs> yes. A new house? Yes, sir. And a car? Hey. Yes, I appreciate you. You're a good man. Oh! <laughs> thank you very much. <laughs> thank you very much. God bless you. Amen. God bless you. Bless you God will continue to bless you. Bless you too. Oh, thank you bless very you much. Too. Thank you very much. God bless you. Thank you. God bless you. Please, you can't do this to me. Please. What exactly are you talking about? <sighs> Delia, you are going to marry my man. <sighs> Delia, that is so unfair. Your man. Who are you talking about? The same man you dumped because of class differences? Oh, wait a minute. And now he is good enough to be called your man? Really? Delia. Delia, please. You can't do this to me. I still love him. Bella, I have always known you to be a befuddled human being. But please, I do not have time for this. I can't bear to watch him in your arms, please. You can't do this to me, I am your best friend, please. Please, Delia, please. Who's there? Come in. Oh, my, 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 I'm fine. <laughs> guess what? What? Just guess. Oh, come on. You know what? Wait a minute. You want another contract? No, no, no. Then what is it? Okay, let me tell you. Mm -hmm. We are going to Germany for our wedding. Yes. A friend of mine who is a reverend father, uh -huh. insisted that he will be the officiating priest oh on our wedding day. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is this is amazing. <laughs> yeah. Come oh, here. Yeah. Oh. oh, sorry. Well. Hi. <laughs> ah, okay. Well. Mm -hmm. Maybe mm -hmm. I might just give you the good news over there. Mm-hmm. Hey, 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 hey. Is that what I'm thinking of? <laughs> what are you thinking? Uh, are you pregnant? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> so 
I am going to be a father. Ah, this is this is so nice. Now, I have a surprise for you. Wait, another surprise. Come on, follow me. Again? Come on, come on. Okay, let me just keep my young. Come on. to go and see your mother. See my mother? See my mother for what? She was here yesterday. You could have told her whatever you wanted to tell her yesterday. See Bella, we can continue leaving as if I do not have the interest in making you my wife. We don't have to go through this again. I just got a new job and I need to concentrate uh, and... And what? And what? Eh? Are we not going to get married? We never discussed marriage and I'm not ready to get married now. Good night. Dilly and I have found an apartment. You did? But, but, but you didn't tell me. But I told you when I asked you for some money. I, I thought the money was for something else. <clears throat> Listen, you don't need to be scared. We can still live together. He sent for me, sir. Oh, yes. Please sit down. Thank you. How are you? I'm very well, sir. There is a saying in my place that what you eat is what your mouth smells like. Did you say that your man is your fiancé? Yes, sir. How did you end up with him? I mean, you are too beautiful and intelligent to end up with such a man. Oh, sir, he's a nice man. Hmm. Our story is a long one. Story? People rewrite long stories to short ones for better appreciation and enjoyment. Look, I'm not saying you should ditch him or break his heart. All I'm saying is, Go and think about it. Hmm? Thank you, sir. I'll take it. Yeah, you may leave. What is it? Nothing. I mean... I think Juma should go back to school. Yes. How do I introduce him to my friends and colleagues as my fiance, let alone my husband? Love has no class, Bella. I think I can sense what is coming. But my advice to you is that love conquers all. I mean, this boy could go back to school. But don't make him feel inferior in any way. 
fees. Young man, hmm? are you all right? <laughs> How can I be all right when this thing is dealing with me? my heart very well, but I couldn't find we have wronged you. Chuma, please, get up and leave. You're embarrassing me in my office. Please leave. Baby, do, you, do you want to kill me? Do you, do you want me to die? Okay, if you want to die, fine. But go to your house. Go home and die, okay? Please, Chuma, Chuma, please. Don't force me to call the security on you. Please. Am I interrupting some? Oh, no, darling. You're not interrupting anything. Just some illiterate nuisance that do not know that this is an office. Bella, that's too harsh. Dahlia, please. Please help me talk to her. Please. Dahlia, I am, I am, I am, I am shattered. I'm shattered. Chuma, it's okay. Just stand up. No, no, don't get up. Stay there and be mewing like a don't leave. Get out. Go, go, go. Fine. That's the file of the 13-year-old girl that was raped at the Baba shop. Take a look at it. Okay, fine. But just get him out of here, please. Mm. Chuma, can I have a word with you, please? Let's go. Nothing I talk, they change your mind. Just got to I will love you. No, tell me why. Before you go, there is one thing you must do. I just need some seriousness in this job. When the time comes, we will live together, okay? Bella say, if you want, I can rent a comfortable and a bigger apartment for us. We don't need to live apart. Why do I have to keep repeating myself to you? This is your house. You have tried for me. It is high time I left. Yes, Bella. No, 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 please, please. No room for argument here. My mind is made up. First thing tomorrow morning, I'm packing into my new apartment. Good night. Bella, Bella is your house too. We can live together. Be husband thief. How could you barge into my office premises to assault me? Have you gone nuts? I can sue you. You have no shame at all. Excuse me. Excuse you? I should <laughs> excuse you. Now let me have the car key. What car key exactly? Have you gone nuts? What is going on? In Mother, what? Why? Why? Look at these this girls of these days. How could you put asunder? What God has put together? Eh? You even dared to ask a question. Kaki? No! Trailer key! Train key! Will you give her that key now, you husband snatcher? What keys exactly? Are you asking me that silly question? Let me have the car keys! 
Now listen and listen, God. This is the last warning I am going to give to you. Stay away from my husband. The next time I come here, <laughs> you won't leave with your face like this. Yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. No, 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 no. You didn't really hear her. Because by the time she's done with you, I'll put those pieces together and set them ablaze. Yes. So stop sleeping with her husband. Because it is evil to sleep with people's husbands. Do you know what you are? Ash, you want me to complete it? What? Then put it two together. Nonsense. What is going on? I don't know. Is it, uh, as if I'm dreaming or in the movies. I, 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 I don't know what is Jamie, going on. Who is she? What happened? How could you do this to me? Do what to you? Oscar. So you're married? What? Oh, Oscar, you're married. We, he, no. He's married? No, see, there, there, there's a mix up somewhere. I, I can explain these things. It's not, it's not what you think. Oscar, you're married. No. I. <laughs> Let me see. I look. Don't touch me! Don't you dare touch me again! How could you do this? How could you do this to me? Oh, oh no, 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 See, this is Dalia, see, no, no, Just shut up! <laughs> no, it's not okay, Dalia, it's not okay. I'll be stupid. <laughs> Just shut up! <laughs> What's could... wrong with you? How could Oscar do this to me? How could he? Just don't do this on TV. Let's go inside. It's okay. Just put yourself together. It's okay. Can you just get lost already? Why don't you go so hard? <laughs> 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 Thank you for breaking my
Someone much better.